This is Limitless Pursuit Outdoors, member of Dashville Face Fire. Today I'm going to get my site set up over here, my deer hunting site. Uh, I got my corn and my feeder all set up here in the side by side and got it hauled over here across the creek. Uh, it, get, it had a bunch of rain the past few days, so the creek was pretty up so I couldn't get across, but now it's pretty low so I can wade across it pretty easy without getting wet. Yeah, I just got to get across, get this stuff loaded across the creek and uh, see you over there. All right, so I got the feeder all set up with the corn in it. Um, yeah, I uh, forgot my knife, so I had to run back over and grab it. It's in the side by side. I tried to use the the tree mount that goes for the trail camera, try to cut it open. That didn't really work very well. So uh, yeah, I had to run back over there and grab that, and uh, probably made him out the fifth trip back and forth from over here. So uh, yeah, and I want to get this uh, the trifecta out, get that little spot for this cleared up right here, and put some of that out because. I mean, you can't uh, get a site set up without the trifecta mineral out, so it always works pretty good for here, and I'm glad to be out here using it, bringing these deer. So yeah, let's get that all set up. All right, so I got this little spot right here cleaned out underneath the feeder, put this mineral out, uh, and now I'm using the trifecta outdoors sweet corn flavored mineral, and uh, I don't use this one very much. I usually been using the vanilla and the candy apple but i want to give this one a shot and see how the deer like it but yeah i still got this little nice little area cleared out usually when i come out i usually put a, about a cup or two cups out solo cups but since this is a new site i'm actually going to put out this whole bucket in this little area i can always go out and get more um yeah if you guys ever want any of this trifecta outdoors mineral it's locally made here in southeastern ohio i'm from meg's county it's, uh, it's where it's made it from uh, you can find them on facebook trifecta outdoors um yeah so i'm going to get this all put out right here i'm just going to spread it out this little area All right, there we go. I got the mineral out, and uh, yeah. So if you guys ain't using Trifect Outdoors, you guys need to go get you some. It's you can find them on Facebook. Like I said, um, after using this mineral, I'm never going back to any other mineral. It really looks looks great. You can look on their Facebook page of all these deer that come in. Look on our Facebook page. We got plenty of pictures of deer. We're all using it now, and it just works amazing crazy how fast these deer will come into this so yeah right now I'm gonna get the camera all set up all right something about right here this little stump right here it's probably about 10 10 feet away from my feeder right here um, it's gonna be a good little spot to get up close personal picture of these deer and uh, hopefully this spot works out pretty good I'm sure it will but yeah I'm gonna get this all right up here on the tree all right so i got my camera all set up back here on this stump um it's about 10 feet from my feeder so yeah it's i can always adjust it i'm gonna leave it out here for about a week come back out here and check it and just adjust it from there if i need to because i won't know until i come get the camera card out but yeah i want to turn the camera around and talk about this little site that i'm going to hunt this year all right so here's the area i'm going to be hunting this year Later this summer, we had people come out here and clear cut. All of a sudden, we didn't know that we were gonna be clear cutting. So I took the opportunity to plant it. I actually came out here about two weeks ago, about a week and a half maybe, threw some fall fall mix seed, some uh, food plot mix from the local feed store. And it's actually growing in really good. I don't know if you guys can see it, but you can see quite a bit of green growing all through here, just little stuff. But yeah, it'll, bunch over here it's grown up really good right here i planted all 
through all here. I mean, I, they didn't they didn't clean up very well down in here, but it looks a little natural when it's all once all gonna come up. But I mean, this will probably be a one time, one year hunt. I mean, this next summer, this is all probably all gonna be brushy, and I won't be able to hunt it unless somehow we can get a bridge built across this creek. It's probably it's just right over there. Get up here and start mowing it, but it's I don't know if we'll be able to do that. But but yeah, anyway. So I hit the feeder set up right here. We got the camera right there on that stump. And up right up here, there's on this ledge, they made a logging path. And I'm gonna actually set my ground blind up there so I can overlook this whole area. I think that's gonna work out real nice. I'll be able to see anything that's coming in, but Hopefully nothing decides to walk behind me on that logging path. That's what I'm afraid of, but I think it'll all work out. I think most of these deer are gonna be on this side of the creek now bedded down like they used to be bedded down over here. But I actually have been bumping some deer out on this side, just coming over here, walking around, look, checking out the clear cut. Yeah. So that's gonna end today's video. I talked a little about this little setup I got going on over here across the creek with this clear cuts going on. But yeah, they're done clear cutting, so I don't have to worry about them coming in here messing up. Hopefully they're done, I think they are, but if not, if it, they come in and mess it up, I can always come back and replant it. I got more seed to plant. Just hopefully they don't knock over my feet or anything. But yeah, I'm gonna get my blind up set up sometime in the next week or so. Um, I need to get some little pins and anchor it down to the ground so the wind don't take off with it. But yeah, I'll be out here in about Maybe this weekend to check my camera, see if anything's been coming in, but they got some nice bucks this year. This nice eight point I've been getting. I've been posting on our Facebook page. So yeah, I think that's gonna do it for today. And got the trifecta out, got some corn out, got the camera. And yeah, this is gonna be my main hunting spot this year. I mean, I got a food plot planted on top of the hill, but milkweed took it over and it's not doing too hot right now, so. Um, I might hunt that. I don't know yet, but we'll figure something out. But yeah. Um, but later this month, before hunting season, me, member, and other members, John, uh, Ethan, and Justin, we're all going to get together and do a big interview video. Talk about our talk about this season and what we expect, and talk about the deer we've been getting on camera. Yeah, so stay tuned for that, and and uh, yeah, we'll see you guys on the next video.